Good afternoon and welcome here to Harding Street in Deniliquin. I'm Brad George, your NITV Murray League commentator this afternoon. On what is a reasonable day as Rumbalara at Deniliquin taking on the Denny Rams. Murray League action 2021, the umpire holds a footy aloft and we're away at first quarter. As I was saying, great conditions here, except for that howling breeze which will be blowing diagonally across pocket to pocket. Ball now inside 50 for Rumbalara. Tap to ground. Nobody can make the most of it there. And it's the Rams now. Top of 50. Let's see what the defence can do there. They get the ball out of the danger zone for the time being. Centre wing. Contested mark. Heavy knock. Well taken for the Rams. Jaden Pitts puts a footy across the centre half back. And a mark taking their chip kicking around. Denny to get things started here this afternoon. Magical day, except for that breeze. And we've got to say big ups and thank you to AFL NSW ACT. Local sponsors. The Edward River Government as well, local government, that have helped out the Denny Rams in the off-season, the COVID break, with the whole renovations and the ground looking absolutely sensational, the playing surface here today. Had a walk a little earlier as the boundary umpire throws it in. And with the break, it's done at the world of good, just as Rumbalara was last week. I think all playing surfaces in country footy have really enjoyed that break. Ball now, top of 50, and the Rams have got it. Just eking each other out here, early part, first quarter, just underneath our broadcast area. And that man again, Jaden Pitts, has got the footy... For the Denny Rams, looks forward, sees what's available. Nothing doing, contested footy. Rumble now, Lara now, across centre half back. They'll look to get it out of the danger zone. So far, the game being played between the two 50 metre arcs. Chip kick on the small pavilion side. Rumble are going to bring it around in front of the club rooms now. On centre wing for Rumba. Let's see if they can make an attack here and get it inside 50. Ball lands fortuitously in the forward pocket for Rumbalara. Chance now for Rumba to put the first score on the board. Minus score. So Rumbalara lead it one straight behind. Denny Rams yet to score. You're watching it here on NITV, the National Indigenous Broadcaster. Right across the nation, I'm your commentator Brad George. And the Denny Rams look to bring it out. Broadcast side. Rex Taylor. Lurking with intent there. As the backman tries to clear the footy out. It'll come just underneath our scissor lift. Kian Wise can't get to it. Denny Rams with the footy again. About 70 out from Rumba's goal. They're going to use the centre corridor now. No mark in the contest there. Ball goes to ground. Rumba will swing it around just in front of our scissor lift here. The give and go. Rexy Taylor and Keegan Wise. Wise now will set sail for home and it'll be a minus score. Rumble are actually force it over the boundary line and we'll get another boundary throw in rather. Rumble are one behind. Lead the Denny Rams yet to score early part first quarter. Here at Harding Street in Deniliquin. Great day for footy, except for that howling breeze going diagonally across the ground. Rumbalara to the town end of the ground. Can't get it into the goal square just yet. Rumbalara now in their forward pocket. They'll swing it around. And it'll be another minus score, I think. Just wait on the goal umpire. Yep, minus score, one behind. Rumbalara, two straight behinds. Lead the Denny Rams yet to score. Denny Rams now a chance to set things up and get things happening. We've gone some four and a half minutes early part. First quarter, the ball's knocked over the boundary line. I mentioned the renovations here. AFL NSW ACT have really chipped in and helped out with the local government, the Edward River Council. Local sponsors and the Renos are really kicking footy goals here in Deniliquin. New South Wales, home of the Denny Ute Muster, where they literally get tens of thousands of people on a site just to the right of screen outside of town. The umpire's going to call for a, another ball in. 
the boundary throw in. Yeah, the Denny Ute muster. Literally tens of thousands of people. Just to the right of screen, there's a massive site out of just outside of town where people gather on the October long weekend, I think it is. And that's a big highlight for the people of Denny. You're watching it here on NITV. Ball goes to ground. Peter Hood tries to get it out of there. And the umpire will call for another ball up. Five and a half minutes gone, first quarter. Another ball up. 70 metres out from Rumbalara's goal. They're up two behinds to yet the score. Rumba, just an up and under sort of handball. Doesn't go to any advantage. And the umpire's going to call another ball up. Another ball up, just adjacent to the centre circles here at Harding Street. In Daniloquin. Almost be in the back, that free kick. I think the umpire sent it that way too. As the players get to their feet, Denny Ram. And that could have almost been 50. The umpire's found the free kick for incorrect disposal, holding the ball. Chance now for Rumba to go inside 50. Standing resolute is the defender for the Daniloquin Rams. They'll bring it around. Just on side 50 now. The ball's been played between the 250 metre arcs here this afternoon. Hasn't really made its way inside the Daniloquin 50. And both teams eking each other out, sizing each other out. Early part of the first quarter here in Daniloquin. And the ball knocked over the boundary line. Jaden Pitts was the man in the contest there for the Denny Rams. And we'll get another broad, uh, another ball in. Just around from our broadcast area. You can see the wind on my page there. Really playing havoc with my notes. And we get another boundary throw in. Just to the right of our broadcast position. Rumbalara, just the two behinds at the moment. The knock doesn't really go to advantage of anyone in particular. The Rams will pick it up off the carpet and fire off the handball. Good chip kick inside 50. Nothing doing there. And the umpire is going to call for a boundary throw in. Rather out of bounds on the full. That's that breeze picking the footy up in the air. If you get an up and under sort of kick. And we've got it on the boundary line here. As Rumble Arrow now will take the resultant free kick. Trying to chip it around and get it further down the ground. You can see a little bit of cloud cover there. We're a little overcast here today. That breeze is causing all sorts of havoc. And if you look, you'll just see the uh, left of screen there, the windsock. Showing that breeze blowing across the ground. Rumbalara now. They'll take it around small pavilion side in front of the Danilicon Rams dress, uh, dressing rooms and uh, their club rooms. Rumba now, they'll look to get it inside 50. Long kick now, we need a few of those today. The connectivity needs to be good. Chance to rumble Ara to swing something toward goal and a minus score. So rumble Ara, three behinds, leading the Denny Rams yet to score. The playing surface in tip-top condition here today, beautiful stuff. The COVID breaks done at the world of good, and a lot of the country footy grounds would have done the world of good with the COVID break. Give the ground a chance to breathe. No football or cricket or any sport played on them in the 12 months we took off for the COVID break. Essentially, the 2020 season null and void in the Murray League. The Eagle Eye Irrigation Murray League 2021. Here you're watching this afternoon. Rumbalara and Daniliquin at the Denny Rams. Shot on goal for Rumbalara now. Another minor score. So Rumbalara move on to four straight behinds. Daniloquin yet to score. Just under 10 minutes gone here. First quarter. Both teams sizing each other out. Rex Taylor tries to apply the tackle there. Nothing too effective. Pack flies. Ball goes to ground and the umpire's found a free kick. Man down. He'll pick himself up, dust himself off.
That's Corey Wanganee now. Thought about the handball of the man running past. He's a fair way out. He'd be about 60 metres out, but he's going to put it right into the goal square. Long kick, top of the goal square now. Who's there to mark it? Nobody in particular. Ball goes to the ground. I think Rumba's got the first goal of the game there. Goal umpire gives the all clear. And a goal to Rumbalara. They've got the first goal of the game. They lead it 1-3-9 to Daniloquin, yet to score. Umpire with the footy, centre of the ground. Another ball up. To neither team's advantage. And we'll get another ball up just in front of the club rooms in the background there. You can see renovations in the off-season, the COVID break here at Daniloquin. Chance now for the Rams to set something up. He'll come around broadcast side of the ground now. Ball goes to ground. Nobody can get their hands on it. On hands and knees, the Denny Rams get it out. Scrambly kick, centre half forward now, top of 50. The Rams are just fiddle-faddling with it. Now they get a kick to set something up into the forward pocket. Rumbalara's got it. Rexy Taylor's calling for it in the officer pocket. Gets the footy, fires off the handball. Turlick's got it just in front of our broadcast position here. He'll chip the footy around. Great uh, attempt on the footy there. Couldn't take the mark, Rumbalara. Jai Yurija is the man who tried to take the mark there. And we've got a boundary throw in. 12 and a bit minutes gone here. First quarter. Rumbalara looking the goods at the moment. They're 1 3 9, leading Denny yet to score. Scrimmage just in the forward pocket there for Rumbalara. And we get another ball up. Nearly recall that one, the umpire. The ball's going to go over the boundary. Boundary throw in. So far this afternoon, Rumbalara and Daniloquin. It's been played between the 50 metre arcs. That breeze is obviously causing havoc with the kicks and the boundary throw ins, but that one was all right. Right at the top of the goal square, Turlick had a shot on goal, couldn't get it. Well smothered for the Denny Rams. Handball now. They're trying to find Rexy Taylor dangerous in the pocket. When Rexy Taylor's sharking around for that footy, he is deadly from the pocket. You're watching Murray League Action 2021. Here on NITV, the National Indigenous Broadcaster, as we wait for another boundary throw-in. Forward pocket for Rumbalara. They're looking to clear the football out so they can get a shot on goal here. Nothing doing, and a chance there, Stephen Stallion. He puts it at the top of the goal square for Rumba. No mark paid. And we're just seeing here, I think it's the Denny Rams players taking the mark, actually. As we wait and see, I think it might be a goal too for Rumbalara. That was snapped there. He'll line it up. Bang. Rumbalara second on the board. That was a good kick. They set up well, Rumbalara. Just a little bit of confusion there watching from the commentary box. But a great goal, Rumbalara. They now move on to 2 3 15. Umpire will restart play now with the ball up. Just in front of the change rooms there. Scramble for the footy on the carpet. Throw a blanket over eight of them. And the ball comes to centre-half forward now for the Rams. Rams a chance to get something done here. But 
Nothing doing. The defense for Rumbalara too strong. It'll go over to the back pocket now for Rumbalara. Chance now for Rumba to bring it around on the small pavilion side, just in front of the club rooms here for the Denny Rams. And we'll get a boundary throw in right there in front of that pavilion, I dare and say. Well, the umpire's going to call for a ball up. Ball up now in front of the small pavilion, opposite side to where we're broadcasting. Knocked to ground now. Chance for the Rams to do something. There's our boundary throw in. We'll get a boundary throw in about 60, 70 metres around from the Denny Rams goal. 16 minutes gone in this first quarter. Not too far away. With the boundary throw in. Denny Rams a chance to swoop on it now. Too many attacking the ball at the moment for the Rams, making things a little bit tricky and congested. Although they've got it inside 50 now, the Rams, and a chance on goal here. Just in the forward pocket, 45 metres out. Bit of an angle. We'll wait and see how he goes with this result and kick. Seventeen minutes gone here at Deniliquin. Long kick and only the minus score, I think. Just waiting on to see what the umpire does. We've got ourselves a goal. Denny Rams got their first goal. Let's get a restart in play after the Denny Rams' first goal. Here at Deniliquin Harding Street, you're watching NITV footy. I'm Brad George, your commentator. The restart in play. Umpire tosses the footy up. Chance now for the Rams to go into attack again. They've got some traction now, the Rams. They're going to put it inside 50. No mark taken. Ball goes to ground. And Rumba will look to repel the attack. Rumbalara now, just in front of our scissor lift here. They'll chip it across. And I think it was Stallion with the football there. Puts it inside, 50 for Rumbalara. No mark taken. He'll have a bounce. Put the eyes down and have a shot on goal here. Minus score. Rumbalara with all the ascendancy at the moment. Chance now for the Rams to repel an attack and set something up. 70 metres around from the Rumbalara goal. Close to the boundary. A little bit of chip kicking. Gets the footy out of the danger zone for the Denny Rams for the time being. Another chip kick. Crunch. Heavy hitting. Rumbalara turned the footy over. They look to put it to centre half forward forward pocket area. Comes around just in front of our broadcast area here. And a good mark taken to Gallagher. Todd Gallagher, the captain. He's looking and directing traffic, trying to set something up inside 50. Forward pocket now for the Denny Rams. And the free kick will go the way of Rumbalara out of bounds on the full. Just waiting for the restart in play here. That breeze is still picking up. You can see the trees in the background. Causing all sorts of havoc with the shot on goal. Chance now for the Rams to have a, a ping at the sticks. Almost in the depth of quarter time here. Boundary throw in. Restart in play. Denny Rams will handball across their half-back line. Chip inside 50 now. 
Who's in the goal square? Nobody set up. Ball's in dispute. And we'll be in the forward pocket now for the Rams. Opposite side of where we're broadcasting. Just on the other side of the ground there. And I think we'll get a boundary throw in again. 20 minutes gone in this first quarter. As we wait for the boundary umpire again to throw the footy in. And we get a long shot on goal there. Minus score for the Rams. Rumbalara now can get it out of the danger zone with the kick in, the resultant kick in. Rumbalara chip it out the back pocket now. Now to centre half back for Rumba. They'll go around the clubhouse side. It's just in front of that small pavilion there. The Rams trying desperately to corral the footy inside 50. And they're looking to set something up, the Rams. Now, like I said, the game's been played in between the two 50 metre arcs. And that's where the ball sits, right on top of 50, right on the 50 metre arc for the Rams at the moment. Nothing really doing in the way of attacking footy. It's just a little bit of kick and hope at the minute. You're watching the Murray League action here on NITV. I'm Brad George, your commentator. James Rigoni on our camera for Sport Focus Videography and the NITV, National Indigenous Broadcasting Network, right around Australia. Thanks for joining us here this afternoon. Last weekend, it was Rumbalara going down to Newmarket by the solitary goal. So they'll look to be getting back on the winner's list here this afternoon. 22 and a bit minutes gone. Siren will be eminent. We're in red time here in the Murray League. Rumbler will see if they can sneak a goal before quarter time. They'll get it right to the top of the goal square. Sells a bit of candy, gets around the player. Now, here's a chance for Rumbalara to do something with the footy. They're going to go and try and set it up. Goes across the face of goals. And a boundary throw in. Forward pocket for Rumbalara. 23 minutes gone first quarter. You can see the grey overcast cloud here. But that wind is really picking up and playing havoc with the footy, especially long kicking here this afternoon. Hence, a lot of chip kicking to get the ball to where they need it to be. Ball now out of the danger zone for the Denny Rams. And we've got another boundary throw in. Opposite side of the ground to where we're broadcasting here this afternoon. Grounds in tip-top nick. The playing surface absolutely brilliant. Long kick inside 50 now for Rumbalara. Not as accurate as he would have hoped. Minus score. Rumbalara doing all the attacking here in the first quarter. Denny now. They'll look to set something up. They'll come around our broadcast side here. Just to the right of our scissor lift. Town end of the ground, you'd say, here at Daniloquin. And another long kick. That's what they need. A lot of clearing kicks. That meet their mark. Gallagher's now got the footy for the Denny Rams. And he'll look to set something up again. He's leading the way thus far for the Denny Rams, Gallagher. Todd Gallagher, the captain. Terrible kick. And we'll get a free kick. Resultant free kick for Rumbalara. They'll bring it back. As I've said many times today, the game being played between the 50-meter arcs. Denny now, chance for them to do something with the footy. And Rumbalara, move it beautifully through the centre corridor now. And a long kick, that's what they need, a lot of long kicking. Gets it inside 50, 
Top of 50, and the mark's been taken. You can see Jake Papoulis trying to make up amends there as the Denny Rams get it across half back and now to the centre wing area. Good heavy knock. And the umpire has seen a free kick coming back to Rumbalara. They'll go inside 50 Rumba now. And the Denny Rams resolute in defence. They'll go for a long kick. Back pocket still for Daniloquin. Big wide open spaces and they're going to look to move the footy across the half back line. A lot of players here on centre wing just in front of our broadcast area. No mark. Ball goes to ground. Now a chip kick. Over the top, Rumble R will turn it around. And once again, we get a boundary throw in just in front of our broadcast area here. Nothing doing for Nathan Turlick. Boundary throw in just to the left of our broadcast area. We're on the scissor lift again today. Thought we may have gotten blown over at one point earlier in the quarter. That wind's really howling a breeze at the moment. Boundary throw-in. Almost quarter time here at Daniloquin. We're definitely into red time at the moment. Bit of a scrimmage, top of 50. And to the right end for the Denny Rams at the moment. Rumbalara now. Kian Wise chips it around. Chance now for Rumba to do something. Forced over the boundary line. And we'll get another boundary throw in. Boundary throw in just around from our broadcast area. The right of our scissor lift. And we are at quarter time here at Daniloquin. We'll be back with more in just a few moments. This is NITV Murray League Football. We're back real soon. Good afternoon and welcome back to the NITV broadcast. Murray League 2021. It's Rumbalara at Daniloquin here this afternoon. And a little overcast, that breeze blowing diagonally across the ground, causing all sorts of grief for the players, trying to get a long kick in. Ball up to get us going in the second quarter. Here at Harding Street, Daniloquin, you're watching it on NITV, the National Indigenous Broadcaster. We're going to get another ball up, not too far away from the centre circles. Grain overcast at the minute, but that breeze still holding strong. And we'll go for our third ball up. Have another crack at it. Rumble R have had all the ascendancy. They're kicking to the left of screen the second quarter. Daniloquin Rams kicking to the right. I'm Brad George, your commentator. Joining you this afternoon from Daniloquin here on NITV. And we'll get another ball up. Ball hasn't gone more than five metres from the centre circles here this afternoon. Chance now for the Denny Rams to have a shot on goal. Get it inside 50. Nothing doing. They're moving the football now. Nathan Turlick's calling for it on the wing. Goes over his head. And I think the boundary line might just beat him here. No. Peter Hood carries the ball over the line. We'll get another boundary throw in. Peter Hood is an absolute Sharon magnet last weekend. He's doing the same sort of thing here this afternoon. Racking up possessions. Good heave ho for the boundary umpire. He'll throw it in. And we're close to another boundary throw in just to the right of our broadcast position on the scissor lift here at Harding Street in Daniloquin. 
Murray League Action 2021. We thank you for joining us here on NITV, the home of late night Indigenous music with volumes as the umpire throws it back in. Gets play restarted, centre wing now. It'll swing around for the Rams and another boundary throw in just around to the right of our broadcast area here. I'm really having to pin the notes down with that gale force breeze that's blowing. Have a look at the trees in the background. That'll give you an indication of how that breeze is really picking up here this afternoon. Across the top of 50 now. Hasn't gone inside for the Rams just yet. Another scrimmage at ground level. And we'll get the umpire to go for another ball up. Scrambly play today, and I think that wind is really hampering the tactics of both teams here this afternoon, and we'll get another ball up. The game being played between the 50-metre arcs here this afternoon, another ball up. Tap to ground now, chance for Rumbalara to get it back up their way. They'll go around the club room side of the ground, far side of the brown. Opposite side to where we're broadcasting. Now in front of the small pavilion. What can Rumbalara do with it? I dare and say this one's going to end up over the boundary line for another boundary throw in. They're chipping well though, Rumbalara. Getting the ball down inside their 50. Into the danger zone for the Denny Rams. And we get another boundary throw in opposite side to where we're broadcasting here today. Just under four minutes gone in this second quarter. Another boundary throw in. Forward pocket for Rumbalara. They'll need a long kick just in front of the small pavilion now. And as I say, any long kicking's been hampered by the breeze today. Goes to the top of the goal square for Rumbalara. Rumba need to pick it up off the cup and spin around, wheel around, have a shot on goal. And the ball quickly repelled. The Denny Rams are trying to get it out of the danger zone at the moment. Yet here come Rumbalara again, right to the goal square. Ball's at ground level now. Rumba trying just even to soccer it through. Can't do so. Ball down for the Denny Rams. Rumbalara yet again. Rumba looking to set something up. Gone five and a bit minutes. Second quarter. You're watching Murray League action here on NITV. I'm joining the scissor lift here this afternoon with James Rigoni, our cameraman. I'm Brad George, your NITV Murray League commentator. As the ball comes into the forward 50 now for Rumbalara. Nothing doing. This is NITV Local Footy. The Murray League 2021. Another boundary throw in. Opposite side to where we're broadcasting this afternoon. Now the Rams will look to do something with the footy. They're going to chip it around. Club room side of the ground. Long kicking's what's required here, but it's so difficult with that howling breeze out there. If the breeze was favouring an end where they're headed towards a town end at the minute, Rumbalara with the football. They'll go to the centre corridor. As I was about to say, the breeze would be worth easy, five or six goals. Chance now for Rumbalara. He'll have a bounce. Put his eyes down, can wise. Goes left, then right. Decides on left, forward pocket. Good mark taken. This is Stephen Stallion. He'll spin around and wheel inside 50. Long kick forward pocket opposite side of the ground now. How will this pan out for Rumbalara? It doesn't at all. And we've got the Denny Rams moving it around opposite side of the ground. Good mark taken. Right in front of the spectators there in the club rooms. Small pavilion side of the ground now. They'll make it away through centre wing.
Rumbelara need to do something effective here to really stretch out their lead. Rumbelara have done all the scoring here today, and the Murray Rams only a, a handful of behinds. Kian Wise is calling for it in the middle of the ground. Here he goes again. He'll have another bounce, Kian Wise. He'll lower the eyes and go to centre half forward now. No mark taken. Ball goes to ground. Rex Taylor tried to jump on it. Ball goes back now with the Denny Rams. As I've said all day, this game being played between the 50 metre arcs. Another chip kick around onto the opposite side of the ground. Centre wing. Right in front of the change rooms there. They'll go long now, the Denny Rams. They keep the ball in, despite being right on the boundary line there. And eventually you're going to get another boundary throw in, are we? No, ball stays in. Just over eight minutes gone in this second quarter. Murray Lee Clash, Deniliquin Rams taking Rumbelara on at home. Ball now for a chance for the Rams to do something. They're going to go to the goal square and put it right to the top of the goal square with Todd Gallagher, I think it is. Sets one up, and there we go. Deniliquin Rams have got their first goal of the day. Sensational stuff here on NITV. And lets the crowd know about it as well on the way back. A high 10 as he zips past. This is NITV Country Footy, and it is the Murray League today. Deniliquin and Rumbelara, first goal of the board to the Denny Rams. Umpire will get us restarted here in the Murray League. Another ball up. No bounce today, despite the playing surface being in tip-top condition. Chance now for Rumbelara now to put it inside 50. No mark taken in the forward pocket. They'll pick it up off the carpet and look to move by handball. Stephen Stallion now has a shot on goal. Minus score, or is it over the boundary line? Over the boundary line of Darren. So I see the wind just picking the football up and swinging it into the forward pocket. Minus score. Chance now for the Denny Rams to repel that attack. Long kick outside 50. Keon Wise is waiting at the back of the pack there. Doesn't get as far as Keon. A left and a right and good couple of handballs there. Good conveyance of the footy, Rumbelara. Now just inside 50. Rumba a chance through Turlick. Firing off the handball. Shot on goal for Rumba. Here we go. That could be Rumba's second goal. Minus score. Only a minus score here in the Murray League this afternoon. Rumbelara, you'd say, kicking to the Mathara end of the ground. And Daniloquin kicking to the town end of the ground here this afternoon. The right of spring for the Denny Rams. Scrimmage right on 50. And the umpire will call for a ball up. Umpire now restarts play. Chance now for Rumbelara. That's right at the top of the goal square. All they've got to do is pick it up and pop it through. And the Denny Rams now with a free kick. will bring it around our broadcast site. Just in front of our scissor lift. Good mark taken. Lowers the eyes. Looks to see what's ahead of him. Further down the line for the Denny Rams. Stallions hanging around, lurking with intent. And we get another boundary throw in. Tim Hunter was the man there chasing the footy for Rumbelara as we get another boundary throw in. The young boundary umpire will have to give it the good old heave-ho against the breeze here this afternoon. Just under 12 minutes gone, second quarter. I'm Brad George, your NITV Murray League commentator. Out on the scissor lift. And we've got a hefty breeze that he's throwing it against. You can see the ball held up in the air there for a couple of seconds before it got to the players waiting for acceptances. 
And we'll get another ball up. Or has the umpire found a free kick in it? Gallagher's got the footy. He's going to try and claim it. And the umpire's going to set him up for the free kick, Gallagher. Murray League action 2021. We're back for round two, where last week it was Rumbalara missing out by a solitary goal to New Merca in the opening round Good Friday clash. This is Murray League action. I'm Brad George, a commentator. Enjoying the day here at Deniliquin. Goal there for the Denny Rams. And we'll get a restart in play. 13 minutes gone, second quarter. Daniloquin getting another score, ready to go, waiting on the umpire now. He's got the footy back at last. Second quarter action on NITV. The National Indigenous Broadcaster. Don't forget volumes, indigenous, late night indigenous music to keep you entertained in the wee hours of the morning. Umpire restarts playing. We've got another scrimmage, another ball up, not too far away from the centre circles. Fourteen minutes gone in the first quarter here. Rather the second quarter. Scrimmage again for the third ball up. After the goal, chance now for the Denny Rams to do something. Goes to the top of 50. Rumbalara across half back now. They've got the footy. They'll put it just in front of the change rooms there. And they'll bring it around club room side of the ground. Fair way away from where we're broadcasting on the other side there. And we'll get a boundary throw in. Just waiting on the boundary throw in now. Ball comes around opposite wing to where we're broadcasting. It'll be about 60 metres now around from the Denny Rovers goal. And we're just waiting to see on the other side of the ground there. Hard to see with the sun in our eyes. Fifteen minutes gone. Can't be too much longer left in this quarter. As Rumbalara now, centre wing. Trying to start something. They're appealing for the free kick. And the Denny Rams have got it. They'll put it inside 50 now, right into the forward pocket. The Breeze got hold of the footy there. But still a good mark to the Rams. They'll have a shot on goal now. Still a fair way out. He'll need to hang it out to the left goal post and let the breeze bring it back in. Back in Gets it to the top of the goal square and out of bounds on the full. That's exactly what the breeze is doing here this afternoon. As I said, he should have hung it out to the left goal post or even the behind post, the way the wind's playing today. And let the breeze bring it back in. Rumbalara will take it off their full back line. Moving it to their back pocket now. Are they going to look to switch play now and bring it over our side of the ground? Nothing doing at the moment. 16 and a half minutes gone. Second quarter. Chance now for Rumbalara. Ball's in dispute in their forward pocket. About 40 metres around, Rumbalara. If they can get the boundary throw in. 
and do something with it, they may get a score out of it. It goes across the face of gold. And another minus score for Rumbalara. Keeping the scoreboard ticking over, albeit a behind at a time Rumbalara. Now a chance for the Denny Rams to get it out of their full back line. Assessing all options. Gets right out of the goal square. And a long kick. That'll get it to the defensive 60 now for the Denny Rams. And we get another boundary throw in just in front of the old scoreboard there. The scoreboard here today for the time being is on the back of a trailer just behind where we're broadcasting this afternoon. Forward pocket now for Rumbalara. Half back for the Rumbalara. Rumba can't get the footy clear at the moment. It's all kick and hope at the minute. Fairly scrambly play being played between both the 50 metre arcs here this afternoon. Latter part of the second quarter. Harding Street, Daniloquin is where we're at this afternoon. Right in front of the change rooms there and the small pavilion. Centre wing. Play on calls the umpire. And we're going to get another boundary throw in by the looks of things. Hard to see on the other side of the ground there. Now Rumbalara turns on the afterburners. And away we go. Small pavilion side of the ground. Rumbalara going to go inside 50 here with a couple of handballs. The errant handball goes to ground at the minute for Rumba. They can't get an effective uh, stat here. And Rumbalara on the small pavilion side of the ground now. Goes back to centre wing. Denny Rams trying to make something of it. And we get another boundary throw in. Just ticked over 19 and a half minutes in the second quarter. Rumbalara with the scoring ascendancy, albeit in behinds. But that is the breeze that's playing hamper with the football today. Anytime the sharing gets any elevation, it's picked up by the breeze, making things difficult for both teams here today. Chip over the top. Centre wing action now. Ball's going to come through the centre corridor now. Rumbalara with the footy. Long kick inside 50. Who's there to mark it? Nobody in particular. The ball goes to ground. And I think that was Peter Hood that had the tackle. And free kick for the Denny Rams. Peter Hood picking himself up off the ground. In a little bit of strife after that tackle. Peter Hood, the absolute Sharon magnet. Wait for that Rumbalara player to pick himself up off the ground. I think it is Peter Hood. Jake Papoulos. I could only see the two. I thought I saw the 2-9 of Peter Hood. Jake Papoulos in the hands of the trainers there. Umpire having a quick word to him, making sure he's A-OK -okay to play on. the Denny Rams will pick up the Sharon and we'll go from there back pocket now for the Rams broadcast side of the ground launches the Sharon no mark taken ball going now inside 54 Rumbalara chance for them to score forward pocket for Rumbalara now And we'll get a boundary throw. And what Rumbalara need to do next to the stick there is to grab this footy and then pop it through for a goal. Just waiting on the boundary throw in. 
And the shot on goal here. Atkinson. Jamie Atkinson. Having a shot, lining them up. Sit sail for home. And he's put it through. Great goal for Rumbalara. You're watching it here on NITV Local Footy, Murray League 2021. Ladder part, second quarter. The umpire's got the share and a restart play. And we're away. Rumbalara doing all the attacking in this second quarter. Here they go again. They're going to look to go inside 50, Rumbalara. Good kick right to the top of the goal square. And I think the breeze may have worked in his favour there. Rumbalara inside 50 now. And this will be a shot 45 degrees out on a slight angle. In the depths of the quarter. And minus score. Rapidly nearing half time here at Daniloquin. It's Rumbalara in the first half had all the ascendancy in the scoring. They've done very well to get themselves at arm length away from Daniloquin for the time being. Still plenty of fizz left in this one, let me tell you. The Denny Rams will look to chip it around our broadcast side, still in the back pocket for the Rams. 24 and a quarter minutes gone. In the second quarter, I'm Brad George, your NITV Murray League commentator. And the umpires paid the mark right on the boundary line as they trip the light Fantango. The Denny Rams are playing right on the boundary line there. And no mark taken, the boundary umpire will restart play. Just around from our broadcast position. You can see my clipboard there in the breeze. Having difficulty holding that one down. Red time in the second quarter here. Boundary umpire will give it a heave ho. 25 and a quarter minutes gone. Siren eminent as they try to hail a taxi and call for the free kick. Umpire will say, I'll ball it up for you. Restart play. Knocked to the ground. Nobody can really pick that one up. Skittled over there, and the umpire will call for another ball up. Not long now before we go to the long break. We're broadcasting today from Daniloquin, New South Wales. Home of the Denny Rams as the footy comes around for Rumbalara just in front of our broadcast position. No mark taken. The Rams have got the footy. Quick hand pass out. Kean Wise has got it. Now picked up. Good chance there for Rumba to get something happening. But once again, over the boundary line, another boundary throw in. Just ticked 26 minutes gone in the first uh, second quarter, rather. And we've got another boundary throw in, waiting for the boundary umpire. Against the breeze, that breeze is blowing pretty much on the boundary umpire's back there. So the boundary umpire throwing it into the breeze. Centre wing, right in front of our broadcast position, well smothered. And that was Atkinson on the smother. Sensational stuff for Rumbalara. And we are at half time. There we go. NITV local footy.